Hi everybody, welcome to the Power of Mom. This is Pow Pow. And today I am sending out a message or a request for anybody that would like to participate. In June, um, we're going to have a special theme, which is the Domestic Violence um, Awareness Month. In June, I will have my one year and a half anniversary of leaving a very bad relationship. Mine was more of the psychological abuse, you know, the threats and, um, you know, hurting somebody or hurting me and such kind of thing. Okay, so this is the deal. I really want to make um, many who have actually gotten counseling, for instance, for domestic violence, we are used to the the wheel of control and um, a lot of times I feel like I didn't it didn't sink in uh, that well so I was thinking after seeing um, the Facebook page of break the silence uh, they were doing this thing where you know you were to give your reason as to why you stayed in the relationship you see a whole bunch of pictures of people putting you know their reasons and this is what I had made for myself I was just gonna do one but then it just I kept on remembering more stuff and there's other stuff I didn't feel like putting in there um, but my idea is this and I would hope that you guys will be willing to participate because I really feel that sometimes hearing it uh, hearing other people say hey this is what was told to me and it's not okay it, like that that will help other people who are possibly in a toxic relationship you know maybe they will start to realize hey you know this is not okay so this is my plan this is my idea and this is it um, I will be making I want to make three videos with your help and this is what I need if you guys can possibly send me pictures of the type of abuse that you endured um, in a little piece of paper like this so I can make a video of it. Um, there's going to be three topics, so try to keep your, um, your flyers separate for every topic. For instance, if you dealt with psychological abuse, um, you guys can probably make me like a 5 or 10 second video. Um, and send it to me saying like, oh, he threatened this, you know? And then I'm going to make a video of like all the th threats that everybody or psychological things that they did to you for you to stay in a relationship. That would be one video. And then the next video is going to be the physical abuse. And you can either write on a piece of paper like, oh, he did this to me or, you know, this is the... You know, um, or you can make a short video saying, this is what I, what he did to me. Um, and then the next video will be a very hard one. I know for a lot of people who went through that, which would be the sexual abuse. I know that one's going to be a little bit more of a hardcore one. And if you guys would like to participate and like I said, make your picture sign or video, um, you are more than welcome to. I know that one's a really hard one also to post. Um, actually, now I'm thinking, you see, you guys are getting my creative juices um, going. There's going to be a fourth video, and the fourth video will be... Good idea. Um, the fourth video will be... You can either do your sign, or you can do your video, but how about we make a video of what made you leave? Like, what was the final straw for you to leave? I think that would be inspiring. <gasps> a fifth video, too. We can make a fifth video of your sign or your video, and you can say, what, what is the good stuff that has come out since you left? So we have five videos that we can work on together, and I hope to have that all awesomely made for you guys in June. And it will be in my website to the power of mom .com. Um, you guys can contact me there any moment um, but yeah June is gonna be domestic violence awareness 
Also, um, you can email me, and my email is to the power of mom at gmail.com. Yeah, I think that's what it is. Um, you guys can send me pictures there. We also have Facebook, which is facebook.com slash T-T-P-O-M. Pretty much the power of mom, but it's just the first letter of each part. So that's our Facebook. Uh, we have an Instagram, to the power of mom. We have Twitter, to the power of mom. We have uh, a Tumblr, which I don't know how to use, but my friend knows. Um, it's, it'll be a little bit harder for me personally to look into the Tumblr just because I am not familiar with it. But if you guys want me to, we can do that. But, you know, leave me comments. Leave me pictures. If you guys want to um, send me your pictures on my um, on our Facebook, you know, just do whatever is comfortable for you guys. And like I said, either send me a picture with your sign or your picture, um, I mean, or a video. Try to keep it kind of sh not too long. But kinda, I want to say... 10 seconds, 5, 10 seconds, maximum 15 seconds, just because we want it to be, we, I want to show the video, you know, just so it kind of runs smoothly, um, so that people that are possibly in this situation, they can see like, oh my gosh, what am I doing here, kind of like a little like a friendly wake up call, kind of like, hey, you know, so, um, I think that would be a really cool idea. So, like I said, it's going to be five videos. Try to keep, if you're going to contribute to several of the five videos, try to keep your signs or your videos focused on one thing because I kind of want to keep the videos um, in their subject just so it kind of hits harder. So, it's going to be the psychological abuse, the physical abuse, sexual abuse, um, your reason, what was the last straw. And I think it might be called like Last Straw. And then also if you guys can, uh, for the fifth video, probably contribute like the blessings that have come when you left. Like what have you made out of yourself? Kind of like in a certain video like, hey, I did this, I did that. Um, for me it would be, um, I guess, well I'll share with you guys right now. My reason for leaving was he almost punched me in the face. And I started screaming because I really thought he was going to punch me in the face. And then I remember just looking at my son, and he was two months old. And he was just, he did like, you know, like the response for kids when they, when, you know, they're in danger like this. It was just frantic. And that's when I knew I had to leave. So that was my reason for leaving. Um, I mostly dealt with psychological abuse, which was the threats of hurting people, um, getting people deported, um, hurting me once my baby was born. That was another one that uh, at one point he said he was going to kill me um, once my son was born because obviously he didn't want to hurt his son. And um, it was just like stuff like that it's, and it's constant, you know. Um, Physical abuse, there were a couple of them, but I, I've seen some of you guys are hardcore, you guys, I don't know, it was, it wasn't as bad as some other people, you know, it was, he got him by the calf and he just started twisting and I was begging him to stop because it was hurting so bad, uh, choking with a blanket, um, fisted me in the face, just kind of like pushing my face down. Yes, stuff like that. Um, sexual abuse. I think I didn't have to deal with that. Um, so I already said my reason for leaving, whatever, the three. And the good things that have happened is I went into a sh shelter. I got help um, so that I can have a home over my head for a little while as I picked up my pieces and I'm almost into this program, but um, I finished school. Um, so I, I should be graduating on my birthday. Um, 
Right now I'm volunteering doing some work for the um, state of California. Don't get paid for it, but I'm getting lots of experience so that when I you know, get a better job, um, I'll be very well prepared. And another amazing thing, which in my opinion is the most amazing thing, is me creating the website to the power of mom, which honestly, it could be for male and women, but my thing is, it should have been called like the power of parent or something, you know, um, or guardian. It's mostly because I feel that when you have the responsibility of a child, um, you, uh, you end up getting this other sense of putting yourself totally last and everything you do is because out of love. Like, you know, like you're defenseless and they have nobody else. And, um. Yeah, so that was one of my biggest accomplishments that I hope that I can inspire people and give people strength because sometimes I feel like I was on my own and I and uh, I had to take a lot of strength out for myself and, you know, um, I hope to be able to make things easier for other people so that they don't have to go through things that I had to go through because I don't think anybody should, not even my worst enemy. I don't wish anything that has happened to me bad in my life. I don't wish it upon anybody, even for the people that hurt me. No, it's um, my main thing, and this is another big thing as to why I want to make these videos. Um, it's because I don't want my my idea is not to be men are the devil, all men are the same. Gotta hate them. No, I have a son, and I I can never hate a man because my son will be a man. But I want to raise him and show him that there's things that people do that are bad, and that's bad, and you don't do them. And I want him, I, my biggest gift to my son is going to be for him to be an amazing father, an amazing husband, and an amazing man. You know, like, make him this amazing person to where he is not going to struggle with dumb things like domestic violence you know it's so unnecessary and it's a cycle that ran on his family for you know a couple generations which is i'm my thing is you know that's the end you know he has me and we're not going to be dealing with that and he is going to grow up this healthy being that is going to be so Good and happy that he's not going to have to struggle with any of this stupid stuff with the police and all this other stuff that, you know, that we have to deal with right now. So, uh, I don't know if it's sorry. So that's it. Hopefully you guys can help me out with this amazing project. Five videos for, um, the week, the month of June, which marks my anniversary. And I hope that you guys can participate, like I said. Message me on Facebook, the website, any of the social medias. I will be keeping track of that. And um, hopefully you can all submit them by the end of May. And if you submit it by the end of May, it will be guaranteed that it will be in our June videos. And um, it's going to be a big project and I'm going to be super busy. But I am going to do this out of so much love to everybody that has been through something like this. And it's a way to help validate also that this is a reality and because a lot of people like to pretend like oh it's normal or oh deal with it or oh you know they're there because they want it no dude like shut up that's not nice and um it's mostly because you've been like the person that you're with keeps on breaking you and breaking you and that's not right so anyways um Long story short, I really hope that you guys can help me with this amazing project. I love you. Take care of you guys. Um, take care of you guys. Take care of you guys. To the power of mom.com. This is Pow Pow and take care. Love you. Boop, 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 boop. And thank you to Break the Silence if you guys decide to link the video um, to your audience and hopefully that would spread into being able to have. Um, you know, more access to people that want to be part of this project. Thank you.